Jesus, 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 O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us, Lord, have mercy on our sins, Master, pardon our iniquities, Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities, for the name, name, sake, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages, amen. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven, give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil. For thy is the kingdom of the Father, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Lord of mercy, 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 glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now, and unto the ages of ages, amen. O come, let us worship, hold on before Christ the King of God. O come, let us worship, hold on before Christ the King of God. When I called upon thee, O God, of my righteousness, so does hearken unto me, and mine affliction now has enlarged me. Have compassion on me, and hear my prayer, O ye sons of men. How long we be slow of heart, why do you love vanity, and seek out the falsehood? Know also that the Lord made wonders, his holy one, the Lord will hearken unto me when I cry unto him. Be angry, and sin not, feel compulsion upon your beds, for what you say in your hearts. Sacrifice the sacrifice of righteousness and hope in the Lord. Many say, Who will show unto us good things? The light of thy countenance, the Lord, have been signed upon us. Thou hast given gladness to my heart from the fruit of their wheat, wine, and oil. Are they multiplied in peace in the same place? I shall lay me down and sleep, for thou, O Lord, alone has made me to dwell in hope. O Lord, rebuke me not in an anger, nor chase me, nor chase me in thy wrath. Have mercy on me, O Lord, for I am weak. Heal me, O Lord, for my bones are troubled, and my soul is troubled greatly. But thou, O Lord, how long turn to me again, O Lord, deliver my soul. Save me for thy mercy's sake, for in death there is none that is mindful of thee, and in Hades who will confess thee. I, I toiled in my groaning every night while I wash my bed with tears, while I water my couch through wrath as my eye become troubled. I have grown old among all mine enemies. Depart from me, all ye that work vanity, for the Lord hath heard the voice of my weeping. The Lord hath heard my supplication. The Lord hath received my prayer. Let all mine enemies be greatly put to shame and be troubled. Let them be turned back and speedily greatly put to shame. How long, O Lord, will thou utterly forgive me? How long will thou turn thy face away from me? How long shall I take counsel in my soul with grievings in my heart by day and by night? How long shall mine enemy be exalted over me? Look upon me, hear me, O Lord, my God, and lighten mine eyes, lest at any time I sleep unto death, lest at any time mine enemy say I prevailed against him. They that afflict me will rejoice if I am shaken, but as for me, I have hoped in thy mercy. My heart will rejoice in thy salvation. I will sing unto the Lord, who is my benefactor, and I will chant unto the name of the Lord Most High. Look upon me, hear me, O Lord my God, and light in mine eyes, lest at any time I sleep unto death, lest at any time my enemy say I have prevailed against him. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the age of ages. Amen. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to thee, O God. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Unto thee, O Lord, have I lifted up my soul. O my God, in thee have I trusted. Let me never be put to shame, nor let mine enemies stop you to scorn. Yea, let none that wait on thee be put to shame. Let him be ashamed which are lawless without a cause. Make thy ways, O Lord, known unto me, and teach me thy paths. Lead me in thy truth, and teach me, for thou art God my Savior. For in thee have I waited all the day long. Remember thy compassions, O Lord, and thy mercies, for they are from everlasting the sins and my use in my ignorance is remember not according to thy mercy. Remember thou me for the sake of thy goodness, O Lord. Good and upright is the Lord. Therefore will they set a law from them as sin in the way. He will guide and make in judgment. He will teach and make his ways. All the ways of the Lord are mercy and truth. Under the mercy under his covenant and his testimonies for the sake of thy name, O Lord, be gracious unto my sin, for it is great. Who is the man that feareth the Lord? He will set him along in the way which he hath chosen. His soul shall dwell among good things, and his seed shall inherit the earth. The Lord is the strength of them that fear him, and his covenant shall be manifested unto them. Mine eyes are ever toward the Lord, for he it is, I'll draw my feet out of the snare. Look upon me, and have mercy on me, for I am one only begotten and poor. The afflictions of my heart and multiply. Bring me out from my necessities. Behold my lowliness and my toil, and forgive all my sins. Look upon my enemies, for they are multiplied. And with an unjust hatred have they hated me. Keep my soul and rescue me. Let me not be put to shame, for I have opened thee. The innocent and the upright have pleaded unto me, for I have waited on thee, O Lord. Redeem Israel, O God, out of all his afflictions. And thee, O Lord, have I hoped. Let me not be put to shame in the age to come, in thy righteousness, deliver me and rescue me. Bow down and near to me, make haste to rescue me. Be thou unto me, O God, to defend me in a house of refuge, to save me. For my strength and my refuge art thou, and for thy name's sake, wilt thou guide me and nourish me. 
Thou wilt bring me out of this never to have hid from me, for thou art my defender, O Lord, into thy hands will I commit my spirit. Thou hast redeemed to me, O Lord, a God of truth. Thou hast hated them that cling to empty vanities, but I have hoped in the Lord. I will rejoice and be glad in thy mercy, for thou hast regarded my lowliness. Thou hast saved my soul out of necessities, and hast not shut me up in the hands of enemies. Thou hast set my feet in a spacious place. Have mercy on me, O Lord, for I am afflicted. My eyes troubled with anger, as also my soul and my belly. For my life is spent with grief, and my years with groanings. My strength hath grown weak in poverty, and my bones are troubled. I am become a reproach among all my enemies, and greatly for my neighbors also, and I fear to mine acquaintances. They that saw me without fled from me. I am forgotten by the heart like a dead man. I am become like a broken vessel, for I have heard the reproach of many that dwell round about when they assemble together against me. They devise to take away my life. But as for me, I have hoped in thee, O Lord, I said, Thou art my God, and thy hands are my lots. Deliver me from the hands of mine enemies, and from them that persecute me. Make thy face to shine upon thy servants. Save me in thy mercy. O Lord, let me not be put to shame, for I have called upon thee. Let the ungodly be put to shame, and let them be brought down into Hades. Speechless be the deceitful depths which speak iniquity against a righteous man with arrogance and contempt. How great is the multitude of thy goodness, O Lord, which I have hid from them that fear thee, which I have wrought for them that hope in thee before the sons of men. Thou shalt hide them in the secrecy of thy presence from the disturbance of men. Thou shalt shelter them in the tabernacle from the contradiction of tongues. Blessed is the Lord, for he hath made his mercy and wondrous in a fortified city. But as for me, I said in my ecstasy, I am cast away from the presence of thine eyes. Therefore hast thou heard the voice of my supplication when I cried unto thee, O love ye, the Lord, all ye his saints, for the Lord requireth truth, and unto them that act with exceeding pride, he rendereth them their due. Be mindful, and let your heart be strengthened, all ye that hope in the Lord. He that dwelleth in the help of the Most High shall abide in the shelter of the God of heaven. He shall say unto the Lord, Thou art my helper and my refuge. He is my God, and I will hope in him, for he shall deliver thee from the snare of the hunters and from every troubling word. With his shoulders will they overshadow thee, and under his wings shalt thou have hope. With his shield, with his truth and compass, thee, thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flieth by day, nor for the thing that walketh in darkness, nor for the mishap and demon in noonday. A thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand, but unto thee shall I not come nigh. Only with thine eyes shalt thou behold, and thou shalt see the reward of sinners for thou, O Lord, art my hope. Thou mayest the most high thy refuge, no evil shall come nigh thee. And no scourge shall draw nigh unto thy dwelling, for he shall give his angels charge for thee to keep thee in all thy ways. On their hands shall they bear thee up, lest at any time thou dash thy foot against the stone. Upon the asp and basculus shalt thou tread, and thou shalt trample upon the lion and dragon, for he has set his hope on me, and I will deliver him. I will shelter him, because he hath known my name. He shall cry unto me, and I will hearken unto him. I am with him in affliction. I will rescue him and glorify him. In length of days will I satisfy him. And I will show my salvation. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. O Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. God is with us, no ye nations, and be vanquished, for God is with us. Give ear even unto the utmost part of the earth, for God is with us. Ye that have prevailed, even ye be vanquished, for God is with us. For though ye should prevail again, yet again shall ye be vanquished, for God is with us. Whatsoever counsel ye shall take, the Lord shall bring it to naught, for God is with us. And whatsoever word ye speak, it shall not abide in you, for God is with us. And the fear of you we shall not fear, neither shall we be troubled, for God is with us. But we will sanctify the Lord our God, and he shall be our fear, for God is with us. And if I put my trust in him, he shall be my sanctification, for God is with us. Yea, I will put my trust in him, and I shall be saved through him, for God is with us. Behold, I and the children which God hath given me, for God is with us. The people that walked in darkness have seen a great light, <coughs> for God is with us. We that dwell in the land and shadow of death, the light shall shine upon us, for God is with us. For unto us a child is born, and unto us a son is given, for God is with us. Whose government has come upon his shoulder, for God is with us. And of his peace there is no end, 
for God is with us. And his name shall be called the angel of great counsel, for God is with us. Wonderful counselor, for God is with us. Mighty God, he that hath authority, the Prince of Peace, for God is with us. The Father of the age to come, for God is with us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit, for God is with us. Both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages, amen. For God is with us. God is with us. No. Beseech you that this evening and night may be without sin, no Savior, and save me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Having gone through the day, I glorify thee, O Master. Grant me, I beseech you that this evening and night may be without stumbling, O Savior, and save me both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages of men, being come to the end of the day. I praise thee, O Holy One. Grant me, I beseech thee that this, that this evening and night may be without temptation, O Savior, and save me. <clears throat> the bodiless natures, the cherubim, glorify and praise thee with the with unceasing hymn. And the six-winged beings, the seraphim, do extol and exalt thee with endless voice. The whole company of the angelic host doth acclaim and praise thee with thrice holy song. For the Father art thou from before all things, who hast also thy Son, co-beginningless. With the equally honored Spirit of life, thou dost show forth the Trinity's unity. O thou, O Holy Virgin, Mother of God, and ye servants and witnesses of the world. All ye choirs of prophets and martyred saints who are crowned with the gift of immortal life. Intercede ye with fervor in our behalf, for we are in much suffering and great distress. So that safe from the air of the evil one, we may cry out and chant the angelic song. Holy, 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 thrice holy Lord, have mercy and save us. Amen. One God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth and of all things visible and invisible, and in one Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of God, the only begotten, begotten of the Father before all ages, light of light, a true God after God, begotten not made, being of an essence for the Father by whom all things were made, who for us men and for our salvation came down from the heavens and was incarnated of the Holy Spirit and the Virgin Mary and became men and was crucified for us, and upon Jesus Pilate suffered and was buried and arose again on the third day according to the scriptures and ascended into the heavens and uh, sitteth at the right hand of the Father and shall come again with glory to judge for the living and the dead whose kingdom shall have no end. And in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceedeth from the Father, who with the Father and the Son together is worshipped and glorified, who speak by the prophets, and one holy Catholic and apostolic church, I confess one baptism for the remission of sins, I look for the resurrection of the dead and life for the years to come. Amen. <laughs> All ye heavenly hosts of holy angels and archangels, intercede for us sinners. O Saint John, prophet and forerunner and Baptist of our Lord Jesus Christ, intercede for us sinners. The holy, glorious apostles, prophets, martyrs, and all saints, intercede for us sinners. Apostoli, profite che martire che pande sagi, presvepsa te i perimonto na martolo. Who are righteous and God bearing fathers, shepherds and teachers of the world, intercede for us sinners. Who is he, Theophori, Pater, Simon, Pimenes, Kedas, Kalitis, Ikumenis, 
O holy heart of John the Wonder Worker, intercede for us sinners. I of Maturia, O invincible and indissoluble and divine power of the honor life giving cross. Forsake not us sinner. O God, be gracious unto us sinners. O God, be gracious unto us sinners. And have mercy on us. Is blighted as for the God of the Mary, holy myrtle mercy in us, for the God, holy Mary, holy myrtle mercy in us, for the God, holy Mary, holy myrtle mercy in us, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy in us, Lord, be gracious unto our sins, Master, pardon our iniquities, holy one of the sitting, heal our infirmities for the name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, which art in heaven, so be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors, and it is not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Thou seest the sleepless watch of mine invisible enemies, O Lord, and thou knowest the weakness of my miserable flesh, from my fashion, or wherefore into thy hands I commit my spirit. Shelter me, shelter me with the wings of thy goodness, lest I sleep unto death, and light in my spirit spiritual eyes with the delight of thy divine words, and raise me up in due time to glorify thee, since thou alone art good and a friend of man. Look upon me, and have mercy on me, for I am one, only begotten and poor. How terrible is thy judgment, O Lord, when angels stand present, men are brought in, books are opened, deeds are searched out, and thoughts examined. What judgment will there be for me, who am conceived in sins, who will quench the flame for me, who will lighten the darkness for me, until thou, unless thou, O Lord, have mercy on me, since thou art the friend of man. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Grant me, O God as thou once did to the, unto the sinful woman, and deem me worthy of washing thy feet, who have freed me from the way of error, and offering thee a fragrant myrrh and a pure life obtained by my repentance, so that I may too hear that long forward voice, thy faith that saved thee, go in peace, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages of men. Having with the old hope in thee, which cannot be put to shame, I shall be saved, possessing thy protection of all things, when I shall not be afraid, I shall pursue mine enemies and put them to flight, covered only with a shelter as a shield, and imploring thine all powerful aid, I cry unto thee, O Lady, save me by thine intercessions, and raise me up out of the darkness of sleep to glorify thee by the power of the Son of God, who is incarnate of thee. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord the earth without corruption give us birth to God the word the very thing to be magnified in the name of the Lord, Master Blood. The prayers of the Holy Father, Lord Jesus Christ, the God of mercy and to save us. Amen. Lord, O oh Lord, that has delivered us from every error that fell by day, do thou deliver us also from everything that walketh in darkness, accept the lifting up of our hands as an evening sacrifice, and vouch save us blamelessly to pass through the course of the night, being untempted of evils, and deliver us from every troubling and fear which cometh to us of the devil. Grant compunction to our souls and to our thoughts, mindfulness of the Inquisition and the terrible and just judgment. Nail down our flesh with the fear of thee, and mortify our members which are upon the earth, that through the quiet of sleep we may rejoice in the vision of the judgments, and remove from us every shameful imagining and hurtful desire, and raise us up at the hour of prayer established in faith, and advancing in thy commandments, by the grace and the goodness of the only begotten Son, with whom we are blessed, together with the no holy and good and life giving spirit, now and ever into the ages of ages. Amen. O come, let us worship and fall down before our King and God. O come, let us worship and fall down before Christ our King and God. O come, let us worship and fall down before Him, Christ the King and our God. Have uh, mercy on me, O God, according to the great mercy and according to the multitude of the compassion and blood of my transgression. Wash me thoroughly from my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin, for I know my iniquity and my sin is ever before me. Against you only have I sinned and none this evil before thee. That thou mightest be justified in thy words and fulfill in our judge. For behold, I was conceived in iniquities and the sins of my mother bear me. For behold, thou hast loved truth, the hidden secret things of the wisdom of me manifest unto me. Thou shalt sprinkle me with hyssop, and I should be made clean. Thou shalt wash me, and I should be made whiter than snow. Thou shalt make me to hear joy and gladness to be humble. They shall rejoice. 
Turn my face away from my sins and blot out all my iniquities. Create me a clean heart, O God, and renew right spirit within me. Cast me not away from thy presence, and take not thy holy spirit from me. Restore to me the joy of thy salvation with the governing spirit. Establish me, I shall teach transgressors the ways, and the ungodly shall turn back unto thee. Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O God. The God of my salvation, my tongue shall rejoice in thy righteousness. O Lord, thou shalt open my lips, and my mouth shall declare thy praise. For thou hast desired sacrifice, I have given it with over an offering, so I shall not be pleased. A sacrifice from the God is a broken spirit. A heart that is broken, and humble God will not despise. Do good, O Lord, and I give pleasure on the sign. And let the walls of Jerusalem be built, then shall it be pleased with the sacrifice of righteousness, with a blaze of humble offerings, and shall they offer looks upon thine altar. O Lord, hear my prayer, and let my cry come unto thee. Turn not thy face away from me in a day when I am afflicted, incline thine ear to me, and in a day when I call upon thee, quickly hearken unto me, for my days are vanished like smoke, and my bones are consumed like wood for the burning. I am smitten like grass, and with it is my heart, for I have got to eat my bread, by reason of the voice, my groaning, my bone hath cleaved unto my flesh, I am become like a pelican in a wilderness, I am like an owl in a ruined house, I have watched him like a sparrow that sitteth alone upon the house top the whole day long, my enemies approach me, and they that praise me made an oath against me. For before the face of thy wrath and I anger, ashes like bread, my drink I mingled with weeping. For after uplifting me, thou hast dashed me down my days like a shadow at a climb. And I am like grass and withered, but thou, Lord, forever abidest in thy remembrances unto generation and generation. Thou shalt rise up in pity upon Zion, for it is time to have compassion on her. Yea, the time has come, for thy servants have taken pleasure in their stones, and they shall feel pity for her dust. And the nation shall fear thy name, O Lord, and all the kings of the earth thy glory. For the Lord shall build up Zion, and he shall be seen in his glory. He hath regarded the prayer of the humble, if not despised, or supplication. Let this be written for another generation, and the people that is being created shall praise the Lord, for he hath looked out from his holy height. The Lord from heaven hath looked upon the earth to hear the groaning of them that be in fetters, loose the sons of the slain. To declare and sign the name of the Lord and his praise in Jerusalem, and the peoples are gathered together, to, and the kings who serve the Lord. He answered them in a wave of strength, the fewness of my days declare unto me. Take me not away at the half of my days, and generation and generation are thy years. In the beginning, O Lord, thou hast laid the foundations of the earth, and the heavens are the works of thy hands. They shall perish, but thou abidest, and all like a garment shall grow old, and as a vesture shall thou fold them, and they shall be changed. But thou art the same, and the years shall not fail. The sons of thy servants shall have their dwelling, and their seed forever shall be guided aright. O Lord, Almighty God, of our fathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and of their righteous seed, who has made heaven and earth with all the ornament thereof, who has bound the sea by the word of thy commandment, who has shut up the deep and sealed it by the terrible and glorious name, who more things fear and tremble before the face of thy power, for the majesty of thy glory cannot be borne, nor can the wrathfulness of the threatening towards sinners be endured, but the mercy of thy promise is immeasurable and unsearchable, for thou art the most high Lord, who is compassionate, long suffering, and plenteous in mercy, and dost repent at the evils of men. Thou, Lord, according to thy great goodness, hast promised repentance and forgiveness to them that have sinned against thee, and by the multitude of thy compassions hast appointed repentance unto sinners that they may be saved. Thou, therefore, O Lord God of hosts, hast not appointed repentance to the just, to Abraham and Isaac and Jacob, which have not sinned against thee, but thou hast appointed repentance unto me that I am a sinner, for I have sinned above the number of the sands of the sea. My iniquities are multiplied, O Lord, my iniquities are multiplied, and I am not ready to behold and see the height of heaven for the multitude of my transgressions. I am bowed down with many iron bands that I cannot lift up my head, neither have any release, for I have provoked thy wrath and done evil in thy sight. I did not thy will, neither kept I thy commandments. Now therefore I bow the knee of my heart, beseeching thee for grace. I have sinned, O Lord, I have sinned, and I acknowledge my iniquities. Wherefore I humbly beseech thee, forgive me, O Lord, forgive me, and destroy me not with my iniquities. Be not angry with me forever by reserving evils for me, neither condemn me into the nethermost parts of the earth. For thou art the God, even the God of them that repent. And in me thou wilt show all thy goodness. For thou wilt save me that I am already according to thy great mercy, and I will praise thee forever all the days of my life. For all the power of the heavens that praise thee, and thine is the glory unto the ages of ages. Amen. He's blighted us, but uh, holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal mercy in us, holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal mercy in us, holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal mercy in us, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages, amen. All holy eternity, have mercy in us, Lord, be gracious in our sins, master, pardon our iniquities, holy one, visit and heal our infirmities, for the name's sake, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages, amen. Our Father, which art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. <laughs> Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Lord, have mercy on us, for in thee we placed all our trust. Be not wroth with us greatly, nor did thou remember our iniquities. But look upon us even now, since thou art compassionate, and to thou redeem us from our enemies. For thou art our God, and we thy people, 
all are the works of thy hands, and upon thy name have we called. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages, amen. Do thou open the portal of compassion unto us, O most blessed Theotokos. For hoping in thee, let us not fail, we pray. Through thee may we be delivered from adversities. For thou art the salvation of the Christian race. Lord of mercy, 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 more honorable than a cherubim of the uncompared, more glorious than a seraphim of the thou corruption give us, but to God the word, the very theotocity do we magnify in the name of the Lord, Master Blood. Through the prayers of our Holy Father, Lord Jesus Christ, the God of mercy, and us, and save us. Amen. O sovereign Master, God the Father, Almighty, O Lord, the only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and thou, Holy Spirit, one God, had one power, have mercy on me, a sinner, and by the judgments which thou knowest, save me, thy unworthy servant, for blessed are thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. <laughs> O come, let us worship and fall down before Christ our King God. O come, let us worship and fall down before Him, Christ the King our God. God be it in heaven, help me, O Lord, make haste to help me. Let me shame and confound it as seek out of my soul. Let me turn back and brought to shame to desire evils against me. Let me turn back straightway in shame that seen to me. Well done, well done. Let me be glad and rejoice in thee all day that seek out to thee, O God, and let them love thy salvation. Say continually, the Lord be magnified. But as for me, I am poor and needy, O God, come unto my aid. My helper, my deliverer, thou, O Lord, make no long tarry. O Lord, hear my prayer. Give ear to my supplication and thy truth. Hearken unto me in thy righteousness. And enter not into judgment with thy servant, for in thy sight shall no man live and be justified. For the enemy hath persecuted my soul, he hath humbled my life down to the earth. He hath set me in darkness as those have been long dead. My spirit within me has become the spawn within me. My heart is troubled. I remember the days of old. I meditated on all thy works. I pondered on the creation of thy hands. I stretch forth my hands unto thee. My soul thirsteth after thee like a waterless land. Quickly hear me, O Lord. My spirit hath fainted away. Turn not thy face away from me, lest I be like unto them that go down into the pit. Cause me to hear thy mercy in the morning, for in thee have I put my hope. Cause me to know, O Lord, the way when I should walk, for in thee have I lifted up my soul. Rescue me from mine enemies, O Lord, and in thee have I fled for refuge. Teach me to do thy will, for thou art my God. Thy good spirit shall lead me in the land of uprightness, for thy name's sake, O Lord, shall thou quicken me in thy righteousness, shall thou bring my soul out of affliction. And in thy mercy shall thou utterly destroy mine enemies, and thou shalt cut off all them that afflict my soul, for I am thy servant. Glory to God in the highest and on earth, peace, goodwill towards men. We praise thee, we bless thee, we worship thee, we glorify thee, we give thanks to thee for thy great glory, O Lord, heavenly King, God the Father, Almighty, O Lord, the only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. O Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, that taketh away the sin of the world, have mercy on us, O Lord, taketh away the sins of the world. Receive our prayer, thou that sitteth at the right hand of the Father, and have mercy on us. For thou only art holy, thou only art Lord, Jesus Christ, to the glory of God, the Father, amen. Every day will I bless thee, and I will praise thy name forever, yea, forever and ever. Lord, thou hast been a refuge from generation to generation. I said, O Lord, have mercy on me, heal my soul, for I have sinned against thee. Lord, unto thee have I fled for refuge, teach me to do thy will, for thou art my God. For in thee is the fountain of life, and thy light shall be see light, O continue thy mercy unto them that know thee, vouchsafe, Lord, to keep us this night without sin. Blessed art thou, O Lord, the God of our fathers, and praised and glorified is thy name unto the ages. Amen. Let thy mercy, O Lord, be upon us, according as we have hoped in thee. Blessed art thou, O Lord, teach me thy statutes. Blessed art thou, Master, grant me understanding of thy statutes. Blessed art thou, Holy One, enlighten me by thy statutes. O Lord, thy mercy endureth forever, disdain of the work of thy hands. Unto thee is to praise, unto thee is to do song, unto thee glory is due to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. <coughs> Most Holy Mother, God, save us. I entreat thee, O all-pure one, thou mountain overshadowed, which the prophet Habakkuk beheld in the spirit, that thou cover me, who am burned by the heat of passions, and that I be delivered from the deadly shadow of grievous misfortunes. Most Holy Mother, God, save us. With the sprinkling of the divine blood, which flowed from the divine side of thy Son, O pure one, wash thou the wounds of my heart, that I may magnify and glorify thee, the ever-blessed and all-immaculate one as his meat, Glory to the Father, and to the Son, Holy Spirit. Thou gavest birth to the Word, who is equally active with the Father, and hath deified the nature of men. Him do thou beseech, O pure one, that he vouchsafe divine ease unto me, who am confused and weakened by the wiles of the enemy, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Grant me cleansing of transgressions by thy divine supplications, O Virgin, for thou art possessed of powerful entreaty, O Mistress, 
from transgressions, suffering, sorrows, and evil circumstances, deliver those who hymn thee. Most holy Theotoko, save us. As thou art merciful, all pure one, entreat him who is ineffable in mercy and rich in compassions, that he take pity upon us, the depressed. Most holy Theotoko, save us. As thou art the temple of the creator of all, entreat the comforter that he make his abode within me, who have become a den of soul-destroying brigands, O pure virgin. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, of the Holy Spirit, at the behest of him who, as God, upholdest all, whom thou didst bear in thine arms, O Theotokos. Look upon me, and deliver me from looking upon the passions as I ought not to do, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O all pure Theotokos, open unto me the loving kindness of thy mercy, and show thyself to be my fervent helper in salvation amid perils. Most holy Theotokos, save us. O only all-merciful Christ, who as God willingly endured wounds and execution by the supplications of her that who gave thee birth, heal my soul, which hath been wounded by the robbers' afflictions of the demons. Most holy Theotokos, save us. I am the work and creation of thy hands, O Creator, but the malice of the serpent hath broken me through the pleasures of life. Wherefore, O Christ, the word, do thou renew me through the entreaties of her who gave thee birth, Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. In a manner past describing, thou gavest birth to the word who looseth men from all irrationality. Him do thou earnestly entreat that he free me who am enslaved by irrational pleasures, only ever virgin, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O most sacred tabernacle, holy filled with light, thou dost ever cause healing to gush forth upon us from thy hand, pouring forth fragrant myrrh upon all, O most pure bride of God, most holy Theotokos, save us. Transform the pangs of my flesh and the grief of my soul and drive away the clouds of despondency, O virgin, thou cloud of the light, and grant health and release from pain to me whom him and glorify thee with love. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Full of every sin, I now set thee as mediatress and advocate before him who is born of thee, O virgin, be thou the correction of my life and my guide, the path of divine understanding. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and Holy Spirit. Sanctify my mind, enlighten my soul, and make of me a partaker of divine glory, O Virgin. For lo, I have been filled to repletion with the evils, and am enthralled to all manner of pleasures. Yet do I offer thee my defiled conscience, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O holy virgin maiden, thou divine vine, who produce the beautiful grapes which pour forth abundant drink upon our souls, give me to drink of his sweetness. Take thou the drunkenness of the passions away from me and save me. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Ever arrogant, I have surpassed the haughty Pharisee in mine and have joined myself to the defiles of boundless transgressions. O thou who alone art pure, Deliver and take pity on me, who am grievously humbled. Most holy Theotokos, save us. O thou whose conceiving and birth-giving were all wondrous, show forth now the wonder of thy mercies upon me, wretched though I am, for I have been conceived and born in iniquities and have become enslaved by pleasures. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I lament, weep, and groan when I remember the dread judgment, for I have amassed only evil deeds. Yet stand up for me at that awesome hour, O Virgin Mother of God, who knewest not man, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. No mind can understand or describe the strange and all-glorious miracle wrought in thee, O pure Virgin. How didst thou give birth, yet remainest pure still? God it is who is born of thee in essence. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Beholding thee hanging dead upon the tree of Christ, Thy pure mother, who knew not wedlock, said, lamenting maternally, How hath the iniquitous and ungrateful assembly of the Jews rewarded thee, having enjoyed thy many and great gifts of my Son? I him thy divine condescension. Most holy Theotokos, save us. There are no works fit for salvation within me, O Lady, for I add sins unto sins and heap evil upon evil. O pure one, by thy supplication, stand before me and save me. Most holy Theotokos, save us. The judgment is at the gates. The tribunal hath been made ready, O my lowly soul. But cry when thou shalt judge me, O word. Condemn me not to the supplications of her who gave thee birth. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Laying hold of the fruits of sin, 
I have been slain, yet do I offer thee my barren soul and cry to thee, O all pure one, show me to be fruitful, O thou who by thy fruit hast destroyed corruption, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O strange mystery, O awesome concept, how hath God appeared on earth as a man, as he knoweth, as he desireth, as is his good pleasure, for he acteth as he wisheth. Most holy Theotokos, save us. As thou art wholly good, having become the favorite of the King of all, Theotokos, fill me with good works, who have lived in evil, and have reached the end of my life in slothfulness, that I may glorify thee for all ages. Most holy Theotokos, save us. As of old, thou didst all gloriously deliver the prophet from the belly of the sea monster, O word of God, so deliver my soul, O word which hath been plunged into the abyss of destruction, for I have thee praying for me, the virgin who gave birth without knowing wedlock. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit. The workers of evil, finding me clad in beautiful raiment, have stripped me thereof. Yet do thou thyself, O virgin Theotokos, array me in divine vesture through repentance, through thy supplications, O Theotokos, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O pure one, thou didst hold in thine arms him who before whom every creature doth tremble, who for our sake became a babe in his loving kindness. Him do thou beseech that he save all who cry out with faith. Thee do we exalt supremely, O all pure one, for all ages. In the shadow and writings of the law do we behold an image, O we faithful. Every male child which openeth the womb is consecrated to God. Wherefore we magnify the firstborn word of the unoriginate father, the firstborn son of the mother who knew not man. Most holy Theotokos, save us. O incorrupt and immaculate virgin, disdain me not, who have become corrupt in mind and soul, have defiled my conscience with evil, and am shown to be devoid of all good deeds, but adorn me with the works of piety. Most holy Theotokos, save us. I have been filled with evils and am full to repletion with thoughts which alienate me from thee who lovest mankind. Wherefore I groan and cry, accept me who repent and reject me not through the entreaties of her who gave thee birth, O greatly merciful benefactor. Glory to the Father, to the Son, Holy Spirit. Through thy supplications, O most immaculate maiden, may I be delivered from all wrath, deadly sufferings, the cruel fire of Gehenna, unjust men and evil enemies, for I flee to thy protection and cry out to thee for aid both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. The all-beauteous one, having found thee to be beautiful of soul, beautiful of mind and calmly of body, became incarnate of thy virginal womb in a way which she alone knew, thereby adorning our ugliness. O virgin, entreat him that we be saved. Peace be laid to us, but all. Holy God, holy Mary, holy mortal, mercy in us. Holy God, holy Mary, holy mortal, mercy in us. Holy God, holy Mary, holy mortal, mercy in us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy in us, Lord, graces and our sins, master of our and our iniquities, holy one of us, and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thy is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and to the ages of ages. <laughs> Amen. <coughs> Have mercy on us. 
Ενίτε αυτό είναι μυζή να εστίε αυτού, ενίτε αυτό είναι το πλήθο τη μεγαλοσύνη αυτού. Κύριε των δυναμεών με θυμών γενου, άλλων γαρεκτό σου βοηθών. Ενθλίψα σύνου και έχω μεν. Κύριε των δυναμεών, ελέη σου ανήμα. Praise him with sound of trumpet, praise him with the psaltery and heart. O Lord of hosts, be thou with us, for we have no other help in affliction, save thee, O Lord of hosts, have mercy on us. Ενίτε αυτόν την πάνω και χρονίτε αυτόν εν χορδές και οργάνω. Κύριε των δυναμεών με θυμών γενου, άλλων γαρεκτό σου βοηθών, εν θλίψα συνού και έχω μεν. Κύριε των δυναμεών ελέησον ημών. Saints, and intercessors, and thy goodness to show compassion upon us. How shall we dare, O Savior, to praise thee, whom the angels bless unceasingly? O thou who knowest our hearts, spare our souls, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Grave the multitude of mine offenses, O Theotokos, to thee have I fled, O pure one, and implore salvation. Visit my enabling soul, and intercede with thy Son and our God, that he grant me forgiveness for the grievous deeds which I have committed. <coughs> Holy and blessed one. Holy Theotokos, do thou not abandon me for as long as I live do thou not entrust me to any human protection but do thou thyself defend and have mercy on me. Unto thee do I commit mine every hope, O Mother of God. Guard me under thy shelter. Lord of mercy, 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 Receive, O Lord, our prayers through this hour and guard our life towards thy commandments. Sanctify our souls, make chaste our bodies, correct our thoughts, purify our intentions, and deliver us from every sorrow, evil, and pain. Compass us above with the holy angels, that guide and guard over their array. May attain to the unity of the faith.
faith and the knowledge of the unapproachable glory. Blessed are thou unto the ages of ages of men. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages of men. More honorable than the cherubim, and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim, the year of corruption. Give us birth to God, the word, the very thought, local seed, we magnify in the name of the Lord, Master of Love. God be gracious unto us, and bless, and cause his face to shine upon us, and have mercy on us. Amen. O Lord and Master of my life, a spirit of idleness, curiosity, ambition, and idle talk, give me not. But a spirit of chastity, humility, patience, and love bestow upon me, thy servant. Yea, O Lord, King, grant me to see my own failings, and not to condemn my brother, for blessed are thou unto the ages of ages. O God, be gracious unto me, a sinner. 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 O God, be gracious unto me, a sinner, and have mercy on me. Hear, Lord, King, grant me to see my own failings and not to condemn my brother, for blessed are thou unto the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now, and to the age of ages of men. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us, Lord, because us and our sins, Master, pardon our iniquities, Holy One, visiting healing and infirmities for the name's sake, Lord, of mercy, Lord, of mercy, Lord, of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now, and to the age of ages of men. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil. And For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit now and ever into the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. You say, felt and protect us, O Virgin Theotokos. O spotless, undefiled, and corrupt, immaculate, pure virgin, lady, bride of God, who by the mother's conceiving has united God the word of man, and joined the outcast, nature of our race, two heavenly things, who only hope of the hopeless, and succor thee, and succor thee, and battle the ready hope of them that have recourse to thee, and refuge of all Christians, and for me, not the sinner, do your first one, who all together made myself unprofitable, by shameful thoughts, words, and deeds, and with the heart's ease of life's pleasure, and becometh all in mine, but as a mother of the man befriending God, do thou, man befriending wise, take pity upon me, a sinner, and prodigal, and receive my supplication, offer to thee on unclean lips, and use in thy boldness as mother, and treat thy son, our master, and Lord, that he may open even to me the loving passion of his goodness, and that overlook of my innumerable trespasses, he return me to repentance, and make me the approved doer of his commandments. And be thou ever with me as art merciful and compassionate, and a lover of good, being in this life a fervent protector and help, to defend me from the assaults of adversaries, and guide me unto salvation in the hour of my departure to care for my wretched soul, and drive far from it the dark countenances of evil demons, and in the terrible day of judgment to deliver me from eternal torment. And show me forth as an heir of the, uh, as an heir of the unspeakable glory of thy Son and our God. Had this be my lot, O my Lady Most Holy Theotokos, by the mediation and help through the grace and love for man of thy only begotten Son, our Lord and God and Savior, Jesus Christ, to whom is due all glory, honor, and worship, with his Father, which is without beginning, and his all holy, good, and life creating spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. And grant us, O Master, when we go to sleep, repose of body and soul, and keep us in, from the murky slumbering of sin, and from every dark voluptuousness of night. Calm the violence of the passions, quench the fiery darts of the evil one, which are treacherously hurled against us, as we subdue the rebellions of our flesh and quail our every earthly material thought, and grant unto us, O God, a watchful mind, to chase thought, a sober heart, a sleep light, and free from all satanic fantasies. And raise us up at the hour of prayer, establish in thy commandments, and holding the remembrance of thy judgments unshakable within us, and grant us to him thy glory all the night long, that we may praise and bless and glorify thine honorable in all honorable and majestical name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages of men. Most glorious of her virgin, blessed Theotokos, present our prayer to thy Son, and our God, and pray to thee, through thee he would save our souls. My hope is the Father, my refuge is Son, my shelter, the Holy Spirit, O Holy Trinity. Glory be to thee. Unto thee do I commit my every hope, O Mother of God, guard me under thy shelter. Peace be unto all. And to the Spirit. Bow your heads unto the Lord. O Lord and Master, plenteous in mercy by the intercessions of our Immaculate Lady, that Augustus and every Virgin Mary, by the power of the honor to life giving Christ, by the protection of the Venerable Heavenly, by the less powers, by the supplications of the Venerable Glorious Prophet, for honor and Baptist John, of the Holy Glorious and Holy and the Apostle, Peter and Paul, the Chiefs of Twelve and the Seventy, who are Father among the Saints, Nicholas of Myra, and Lisha, of the Holy Glo- of our Righteous and God-bringing Fathers, 
Clementino, my father, the wonder workers, Seraphim of Sorrow, from an Alaska, in the Santa Juvenile of Alaska, the Kanta Confessor, Patriarch of Moscow, Peter the Allot, of our fathers among the saints and new confessors, Philard of New York, Glicari of Romania, Christoph of Falerna, of our righteous mothers, Xenia Teresa of Fools for Christ's sake, of our holy patron, John Maximovich, Archbishop of San Francisco, the wonder worker, of the holy and righteous ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, of our righteous father, John Abbot of Sinai, and the author of the latter, whose memory we keep and of all thy sins, make acceptable our supplication. Amen. Grant us remission of our offenses. Amen. Shelter us under the shelter of the wings. Amen. Drive far from us every enemy and adversary. Amen. Make peace for our life. Amen. O Lord, have mercy upon us and upon thy world, and save our souls, since thou art good and the friend of man. Amen. <clears throat> Bless holy Father, so forgive me, sinner. Let us pray for the peace of the world, Lord, for Christians, Lord, and our tax Christians, for Father and Archbishop Dimitrios, for the Lord, and all our brethren in Christ, Lord, for our absent fathers and brethren, Lord, and for those that minister and minister Lord, unto us, for those that hate us and those that love us, Lord, and for those that have enjoined us the unworthy to pray for Lord, them, for the release of captives, Lord, and for the safety of those that travel by sea land and air, for those that are lying ill. Lord, and Let us pray also for the abundance of the fruits Lord, of the earth, and, and for the soul of every Orthodox Christian. Let us bless the pious kings, the Orthodox bishops, the founders of this holy monastery, our parents teachers and all our fathers and brethren have gone to their rest before us. The Orthodox here never are piously laid to rest. Eternal be their memory. And let us say also for ourselves. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. Lord Jesus Christ, and O God, have mercy me. 
the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with the Lord Jesus Christ, Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus Christ, and the God of mercy, with Lord Jesus
Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, 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 Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me. Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me. Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me. Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me. Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me. Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me. Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, me, 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 Lord Jesus Christ, and God of mercy, and us and save us. Amen. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Be me worthy, my Lord, to behold thy mercy in my soul before I depart this world, and at that hour to sense within me comfort along with those who in good hope have gone forth from this world. Open my heart to my God by thy grace, and purify me from communion with, from communion with sin. Make smooth in my heart the path of repentance, my God and my Lord, my hope and my boast. My strong refuge by whom mine eyes are illumined, and give me understanding to the truth. Deem me worthy, O my Lord, to taste the delight of the gift of repentance, whereby the soul is separated from the working of sin and the will of flesh and blood. Deem me worthy, my Lord, to taste contrition, wherein the gift of your prayer is deposited. May I attain my service to the wondrous crossing, whereby the soul forsakes the visible world, and there arise and her new thoughts for entrance into a spiritual world, world and experience of new perceptions. Amen. Please continue the of our Holy Father, the Amen. Instruction eight on resentment. Evagrius said that a man must not become angry or upset with anyone. And again, he said, if one bridles anger, he also bridles the demons. But if he has been overcome by this passion, then he has become a complete stranger to the monastic life, as well as other related things. What then do we have to say of ourselves that we do not stop at anger and rage, but many times reach the point of resentment? What can we do save mourn for our pitiful human condition? Let us therefore keep the eyes of our souls and our bodies vigilant, my brethren, and let us attend to ourselves that we might, with the help of God, redeem ourselves from the bitterness of this destructive passion. For it often happens that one does a prostration to his brother when there naturally occurs some disturbance or upset between them, but he still remains sad and harbors some thoughts against him. He who is warring with these thoughts should not be indifferent to the matter, but should stop them immediately, because this is resentment. And there is a need to exercise caution with vigilant care, to repent and to struggle, as I have said, not to remain for any length of time with these thoughts and to be endangered by them. Because by making a prostration, one simply conforms himself to some practical commandment and temporarily confronts the issue of anger, but wages no combat, combat against resentment. And for this reason, there remains with him a sadness regarding his brother. For resentment is one thing, rage another, anger yet another, and perturba perturbation yet something else. I will give you an example so that you may understand. When someone lights a fire, he at first has a small piece of kindling. The kindling is a small word of the brother who causes him sadness. See what little strength the kindling has. What is a small word from a brother? If you wait a while, like kindling, you will go out. <clears throat> but if you start thinking about it, why did he say that to me? And I can answer him back. Or if I did not want or if he did not want to upset me, he would not have said that to me. Or, believe me, I can put him straight. Behold, you are throwing small logs or some kind of fuel or some other kind of fuel on the fire, just as someone wishing to start a fire would do. 
and you fill the place with smoke, the smoke being perturbation. Perturbation is the evolution of passionate and unruly thoughts which stimulate the heart, making it bellicose. This bellicose attitude towards people who upset us many times takes on a threatening character. Since it becomes vengeful, as Abba Mark said, evil that is accepted in thought makes the heart brazen and vengeful, while if such evil is opposed by prayer and with hope, the heart is made repentant and contrite. For if you had endured the insignificant word of your brother, as I said, you would also have put out the little fire before it stirred up perturbation. But even now, if you so wish, this little fire is easily put out, while you still have time with silence, prayer, and heartfelt repentance. If, however, you persist in smoldering in this manner, you will be provoking and emboldening your heart and bring back to your mind these things. Why did he say that to me? Or I can answer him back. With all of this churning up and scrambling all of your thoughts, the heart is ignited and stirred by passion. The passion of anger flares up, for anger is the inflammation of the blood that is found around the heart. St. Basil the Great tells us, so it is that anger comes about and we find ourselves in the state that is called irascibility. If now you wish to do so, you can even extinguish this before it brings you to rage. If, however, you continue agitating others and letting yourself be agitated, you will become like the person who places wood on a fire, building up the flame. Thus, the wood becomes the fuel for hot charcoal which is akin to rage. This is also what Abba Zosimus said when he was asked about the meaning of the phrase, where there is no anger, conflict subsides. Because if at the onset of a conflict, though there be smoke and sparks may fly, if before upset occurs and becomes anger, one hastens to censure himself and makes a prostration, as we have said, then he will remain at peace. Likewise, should anger be incited, if he does not remain calm but allows upset and revenge to come into his soul, he becomes, as we said above, like one who throws wood on a fire, giving it fuel for it to become a great blaze. Just as kindling can turn into, a lar into large cinders that can be stored for a long time without disintegrating, even if water is thrown on them, so it is with anger. If it remains for a long period of time in the soul, it becomes resentment. At that point, saved by sweating blood, one cannot free himself from it. Now that I have told you the difference between these things, you can understand. You have heard about initial upset, what anger is, what rage is, and what resentment is. Do you see how from a simple exchange one can come to such a great evil? If from the onset, however, one blames himself, enduring the words of his brother, not looking to seek revenge and saying just one word instead of answering with two or even five words, rendering evil for evil, he will be saved from all of these advers adversities. For this reason, I always tell you, while the passions are yet only beginning to manifest themselves, cut them off before they grow strong within you and cause you <coughs> distress. For it is one thing to pull up a small it is one thing to pull up small weeds, another to uproot a large tree. The prayers of our Holy Father, Lord Jesus Christ, our God have mercy and save us. The prayers of our Holy Master, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy and save us. Amen. Okay. Amen. 
sing thine angels slaughter, O Christ, the pure virgin cried in grief, O most sweet child, how is it that thou diest lawlessly? How is it that thou hast suspended all the earth upon the floods of waters, are now thyself suspended from the tree? O most merciful benefactor, do not leave me, thy mother and handmaid alone. Don Stavro. Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. 
Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, in mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, in mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, in mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, in mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, in mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, in mercy on me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, in mercy on me, a sinner.